I personally feel personalized medicine is medicine that is personalized so to each patient uh, and I feel as, as oncologists we all share this feeling that we don't treat numbers we treat patients it's ahead of us and we it's great to see numbers come down if the patient's not feeling great that's not good it's not a good feeling uh, and amyloidosis makes that way actually a little bit more complicated than myeloma because you're sort of juggling multiple different organs with with the heart the nerves the the kidneys and having to do all of that sometimes gets a little bit um, overwhelming um, so our approach and I feel what should be everybody's approach is that having a multidisciplinary approach for the patient where you know you have all the selected specialties coming together hematology cardiology neurology nephrology physical therapy nutrition genetics all of them working together as a team with the patient at the center of that team is the most likely to give the patient the best approach um, and uh, multidisciplinary clinics have been around a lot but I feel in rare diseases like amyloidosis it's, it's even more important because a, you kind of bring, bring the best out of all the experts that are in the field, but also two, it improves access to care where patients can just come to the one multidisciplinary clinic and get all their needs addressed there as opposed to having to travel from one office to another office. And the COVID pandemic has showed us that access to care is very important um, and, and making that more easily available to patients is, is invaluable.